Rizzy. Rizzy. Rizzy, here. Hey guys, what are we drinking today? Wine or vodka? It's just too cold today. Vodka. Today we're cooking borscht. Alan, slice the meat. Warm vodka is better. Alan, let's warm up a little. You're, come on. Well, today we have a guest here. A word to our guests. Thank you. It's not my first time here in Caucasus. I always enjoy coming here. I love famous Caucasus hospitality. We always get warm welcome here. All right, here's to our get together. To our get together. Good pieces, as we like them. Alan, I think we overloaded our dish with meat. There's no such thing as too much meat. Ready? Thank God we got together. One more time. Welcome. Dennis, we better slice the beetroot. Well, Georgie, slicing it is. I'm going to shred the cabbage. We won't need it yet. But chopping onions would be a lot of help. Alan is really good at chopping onions. Mm. Vitamins. Vitamin. Guys, do you know what part of the body cabbage makes grow bigger? Georgie, I know, but I better keep my mouth shut. What I'm getting into the head, I don't know what it was. Here goes the meat. Every borscht has its own recipe. No, potatoes need to be chopped. 
I've never seen potato pieces in my grandmother's borscht. Maybe she just mashed it. And it looked mashed and not cut. You haven't had the right kind of borscht. The right way to do it is to cut the pieces. It just boils down, that's it. It can boil down. Of course it can. This is called, this is called borscht argument. Let's salt it. <laughs> Let's give it a try. Five more minutes and it's ready. The goat is very young. Nope, look, it's still raw. Five minutes or even ten. Throw in a couple of bay leaves. Several black peppercorns. Throw in the potatoes. Yura, tell us, is the goat ready? Yes, it is. Welcome to the table. Excellent. While borscht is boiling, we will have grilled meat. I don't see why we can't raise our crystal glasses to this beautiful lamb that is being served. It's not a lamb, it's a young goat. Yeah, come here. Wonderful. Well, I am very glad to see everyone on this frosty December day. Here's to your health and wealth. Mm. Hold it. The skewer. Oh, okay. Oh. I don't know what piece to try first. Is it well done? I don't know. Taste it. Mmm. Mm. Young goat is perfect. Such yummy lamb chops. I think there's not enough beetroot. Borscht needs to be really red. I will slice some more. 
Alan, we need a couple of ladles of broth here. Is it almost ready? It's not as red as I want it to be. It's red all right, very red. We can make it redder. Cabbage. Did we throw in the cabbage? As they say, the spoon must maintain vertical position. It does. Let's add some greens and borscht. It's almost ready. Three minutes of steaming, and we can set the table. It's so rich. And what about meat? I don't see any meat. Not enough. I told you it needs to be red. It's red enough, they said. Well, today we've cooked borscht, and I'm really glad. I want to raise this glass to Caucasus hospitality. Thank you. Hurrah! To your health. Let's taste our borscht. Very thick, homemade. Of course, I want it to be very red. But I guess we did something wrong here. Maybe there's too much meat. That's why it's not red enough. Mm. But very tasty. Have you tried borscht with rye bread and garlic? Of course. It's absolutely delicious. Mm, 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 mm. 